goes into that account, you don't touch that money until you retire. Hello, I'm Sam Loza. I am the college and career coordinator here at Madras High School. The Fab Life. So it is um, a financial literacy game that is produced by ECMC. They are a nonprofit organization and their main focus is on educating students about um, college debt. So we start off by giving the kids a, a scenario that is um, includes their occupation, um, a salary, an annual salary. My profession was general manager for a hotel. My salary was um, 50000 600 and something. Each scenario will tell the student what level of education they've received, um, whether they have children, how many children, and what the ages are, and along with their marital status. It really includes real life stuff, like, you know, for an example, for me, I had one kid, a five-year-old boy, and I had no wife. So using that scenario, they then are going to build a budget and they're going to go shopping for the different resources and services that uh, a normal American household would usually need to go purchase. I thought it would be easy. One portion is the crystal ball card. The crystal ball card could be something great, like you could have, your grandma sent you money, um, or it could be you totaled your car and now you have to buy a new one. Um, so just like real life, um, sometimes things happen. Sometimes it's lucky, sometimes it's not. So it's balancing now your regular budget and then how are you going to afford these additional costs that might come up. Like I thought I could keep myself sustained, but then I realized I had a bachelor's degree, then that would mean I have debt, that would just keep piling up, and I would have to take care of my kid, you know, get a house, get a good car so I can take them to school, furniture, food, groceries, and by the end of it, by the end of all of it, I was, I was in debt. I was like uh, $17,000 in debt. I think the value of it is that they really are seeing what a budget really entails, like how many different services and things that we need as adults, um, where our money goes, where does our paycheck go every month, you know? The lesson I have learned from this is that I have to figure out how to easily get through life while sustaining good money.